fine line sometimes between making a play and not getting hit or making a play and getting killed. This close, a lot of times. With the ball, if you hit it hard, it's probably going 120 miles an hour. So if it hits you in the face, it's definitely gonna break something. Going fast and it's a thousand pound animal and you know you don't wanna be going 30 and hit the ground and then have a thousand pounds on top of you. And all I remember is waking up in the hospital and uh, not being in control of my body. And having to go out and play a game knowing that that was happening right next to us was probably one of the darker moments of all of our polo careers. Polo is like a drug. It's like it just, it's in you. There's only two ways you're going to stop playing polo is if you go broke or you die. Favorite aspect? Horses. You have to love them if you play this pole sport. My favorite part is the game, but I love the horses. You know, it's a lifestyle. People who love or that play polo, I mean, they love the horses. Jeff Hall. Jeff is, uh, you know, I've known Jeff since he was about eight years old. He bought his first horse from my wife and I. I bought my mare with my first check, first good check. Then I, and I took that check and just signed it over and bought this horse. working with horses and being on the ranch all the time. I don't have so much fun with these guys, no matter what we're doing, you know? It's polo or golfing or whatever, I just enjoy, I enjoy spending time with these guys, definitely. When you get to be on teams with like really good friends, you know? You have like those buddies that you hang out with and you know, we always go to the same place and play in the same tournaments, but you know, you're usually playing against each other. But uh, when it happens that you end up on the same team, it's, it's a blast. What's, what is, what's your like off the field? Yeah. Best buddy. Yeah. Best buddy for sure.